I've always had dreams and ambition to maybe serve uh, in public office one day. I just never thought it would come at age 35. It was James Madison that gave me the foundation uh, to even think about uh, ever having the opportunity of achieving a dream like being a public servant. I want to bring people together because Richmond has had a, a history of division. In, in, in the earlier days, it was you know, African Americans and, and white Americans located right here in the city. And nowadays, some would say generationally, you know, folks who've moved to Richmond versus folks who have been in Richmond for many, many, many years. But we all know that we are a stronger city when we're, we're all working together. I tell a lot of young people every single day that you want to have a job where your passion intersects with your skill set. And it was at James Madison where I, I fell even more in love with public service and, and politics and government and had an opportunity to learn not only in the classroom but also outside the classroom being uh, in student government for all those years. There's always been someone who saw something in me that I probably didn't see in myself. Many of my professors uh, in political science were those individuals who saw something in me and uh, what I've intended to do in life is to, to kind of pay that forward. And that's why I love this job, because I get to make such an impact in everyday people's lives that if I can change one person's life and they can come back 20 years from now and give that same story that, you know what, this wouldn't have happened if uh, Mayor Stoney wasn't engaged or involved, I mean, that's something to live with right there. That's something to, to stand by.